Ever wonder how artificial heart transplant surgery is actually performed? It's one of the most complex and fascinating procedures in modern medicine. First, doctors put the patient under general anesthesia and connect them to a heart-lung machine that keeps blood pumping and oxygen flowing while the heart is stopped. Then, the damaged or failing heart is carefully removed, but sometimes the back walls of the heart's atria are left in place to help connect the new device. The artificial heart, usually made from biocompatible materials and powered by an external controller, is then implanted and connected to the major blood vessels. Surgeons meticulously attach tubes that will allow the artificial heart to pump blood through the body, mimicking the rhythm of a natural heart. Once everything is in place, the team checks for leaks, ensures the device is functioning, and slowly weans the patient off the heart-lung machine. The entire process can take several hours and requires a team of specialists. After surgery, patients need careful monitoring. 